This isn't just your ordinary gimbal. Today I'm reviewing the Feutech Scorp 2. It has advanced AI technology built in that enables you to get dynamic shots that track you without the need for another gimbal operator. If you're a solo filmmaker trying to film yourself, this feature will come in clutch. If you're looking for a new gimbal to add to your arsenal, I'm gonna be going over some of its other features as well. But first, my name is Jonah August. I'm a wedding filmmaker based in Vancouver, Canada, and I'm happy that you're here. A quick disclaimer, Feutech did send me this gimbal to review, but I will be giving my honest opinion. Now, previously I have reviewed the Scorp Mini and I shared about its vast functionality and the purpose for its buttons and knobs in that video. So make sure you check it out as its features are quite identical to this updated gimbal, but this one definitely has some updates that are superior. All right, let's jump right into this. This kit comes with all the different types of cables for connecting your camera to it and a bunch of other accessories for mounting and stabilizing. Its payload is 2,500 grams, which is about five and a half pounds. The gimbal itself is just over 100 grams, so you won't get exhausted holding it. It's not waterproof, so don't risk it out in the rain. It has 13 hours of battery life and takes less than two hours to charge it. It has all the follow modes you'd like, pan, pan tilt, pan tilt roll, flash follow, and lock mode. The menu system is easy to navigate with its touch screen. It has a dedicated joystick, record button, and custom buttons, and controls all over the gimbal. A multi-function knob. Dedicated legs built in so you can confidently let your gimbal chill on its own. Now the newest feature is its AI capabilities. Just by hand motions, you can enable the gimbal to follow you wherever you go. It's kind of cool if you're on your own and you wanna get some creative shots. Moving on, I took the Scorp 2 out for a cinematic test video and I'm quite happy with the results. I kept my shots nice and smooth and its usability was a breeze. It's actually really difficult for me to think about anything that I don't like about this gimbal. It's priced at 369 US dollars, which is really awesome for a gimbal with this payload. So take a look at this test video and let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks so much for watching. The product is linked in the description and I'll see you in the next video.